Hey guys, it's Photography Adventures by Gracie L. Gracie Luttrell. Today we are out taking bird photography of several species and today I thought that we would run over how important are neoprene covers to your camera lens and your camera. The first thing I want to talk about is how it keeps your camera and your lens protected from water. Neoprene itself is waterproof so that helps to protect both your lens and your camera from being waterlogged. The next thing I want to talk about is scratches and anything that cause damage to your camera. Neoprene is also very thick, but just thin enough that it doesn't cause too much problem. So that also helps with protecting your lens and your camera from getting damaged. Last but not least, I would like to talk about how it also it keeps your camera camouflaged in with the natural elements so right now i'm not really in the natural elements but i chose a color that would blend in very well to the appalachian surroundings and would keep both me blended in and would keep make the animals eat feel even more safer from me photographing them from a distance and you can see that it's very well threaded to keep it tight it's very very tight and snug to the lens which is what you want so that way there's no room for any water or anything to get in between it. One day I need to do a video on peak design um, camera straps. So comment below if you'd like to see that. But this camera has had a lot of new doodads added to it as we say. And I have to say the neoprene cover has been super nice as an add-on. The next question that I'm going to answer is, is that how do you buy a neoprene cover that's not that expensive? Well, this one was not that expensive. It was around $65, I'm pretty sure, which is not real high compared to the $200 neoprene covers that's on average. But it did ship in from the UK and import, so I did have to wait a little while, but it was totally worth it in the outcome because it was only like four weeks that i had to wait on it which is not very long compared to it was during the christmas holidays and it was already even from the u.s it could take up to two weeks to get something in so it was only really two more weeks more and i was super impressed to how quick it got here another question that you guys may have is is that you can notice my settings are in this plastic so how do i change them well, even with it being snug, I can still slip and just barely tuck it back and I can be able to move the dials with my fingertips and that way I can adjust the settings. 